to Senator Sanders and do the work of reunification, of unification of the party, however you want to see it. I ask this because Senator Sanders has said to me in the past and to many others, it's not my job to get my supporters to vote for Hillary Clinton. Clinton has to make the case to these supporters. And given what you're seeing with this increase in hostility and antagonism towards the process within the primaries on the Democratic side, should you reach out to Bernie Sanders and say, let's, let's start doing this the right way. Let me start talking to the supporters. From your perspective, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. have you done that? Have you thought well, of doing I, that? I I've said many times what I've just said to everyone, including his supporters. And I am absolutely committed to doing my part, more than my part. But Senator Sanders has to do his part. That's why the lesson of 2008, which was a hard fought primary, as you remember, is so pertinent here. Because I did my part, but so did Senator Obama. He made it clear, he welcomed people who had supported me. He made it very clear. We went to Unity, New Hampshire together, appeared together, spoke together, and made it absolutely obvious that I was supporting him, he was grateful for that support, I was reaching out to my supporters. He was telling you his... You nominated to, uh, Senator I, Obama at the convention. I did. And, Bernie and, Sanders is saying he's going to fight all the way through the convention. Well, it's different. He, he has to do his part to unify. He said the other day that he will do everything possible to defeat Donald Trump. He said he'd work seven days a week. I take him at his word. I think the threat that Donald Trump poses is so dramatic uh, to our country, to our democracy and our economy, uh, that I certainly expect Senator Sanders to do what he said he would. Any thought to your making the first move uh, and reaching out to make that process happen now as opposed to months from now? Well, I have, we have, we've had lots of conversations between people who know me well and support but him. But not directly? Well, he knows exactly what I'm saying. He, he hears it all the time because I have said the same thing. I respect him. I understand uh, the very passionate advocacy he feels for the issues he's been uh, really pounding away at for years. You know what would bring and you two together very quickly?